It was a long summer for a Central Florida 12-year-old. Nearly two months after getting bitten by a shark, the boy says he is ready to get back to school. News 6's Molly Reed is following his recovery from Volusia County. A lot of people are really nervous when they first surf there because it's shark the capital of the world. With a love for surfing, though, Jay Villamil, a 12-year-old from Cocoa Beach, ventured to New Smyrna on June 14th with a surf coach and friends. I just got off the wave and I stepped off my board to turn back out. And then I thought I was getting bit by a dog because it, it took me a while to admit, register that I was like, I'm in the ocean. That surf coach, Charlie Hajek, rushed to help, wrapping a board leash around Jay's leg to stop the bleeding. The most terrifying thing ever. Jay's mom, Jamerica, rushed up to New Smyrna. The bite ripped a nerve and tore Jay's Achilles tendon. After four surgeries, he will head to his first day of school on a scooter and boot. His wounds now scars and mostly scabbed over. I can't walk for like the next four months probably because... My nerve, I don't have any feeling on the bottom of my foot. A GoFundMe was set up by friends, raising close to $40,000 so far. Demerica says the community support has kept his spirits up. He doesn't complain too much. He just does it. He's getting around on his scooter. Jay hopes he'll be back in action soon to play soccer this fall and hit the water again. He loves it. And he likes it. I love it. But um, I don't know about New Smyrna. <laughs> Beach Patrol says so far this year there have been a total of nine shark bites in Volusia County. The most recent one happening just this past Saturday. More than half of them this year happening right here in the New Smyrna Beach area. In Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting results. News 6.